Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our tech is and in this video I gonna show you how can you downgrade your iOS 11.0 device to iOS 10.3.3 without losing any data. So basically this is iPhone 5s in my hand and it's running on with iOS 11.0. And so first of all uh, to downgrade uh, to your system you required a iTunes on your computer that is the iTunes must be a latest version you can download the iTunes from the given link below the description after downloading the iTunes just install the iTunes to your computer and after installing that you require a cable which comes with the phone uh, so this is the cable and simply connect the cable to the phone and plug it to the computer okay now uh, now just uh, again it's not charging okay now it's connected properly with the computer and when it shows the charging option on the top just simply hold the uh, home key and the power button until the phone gets off just hold it for uh, 10 seconds up to the power key and the home key and when it's off just simply only hold the home key and it will open on iTunes screen so here it is the phone will boot on the itunes mode so here it is this is now on itunes mode and in computer you will get this option update restore just you need to click the update not do not press the restore if you click the restore then your data will be lost so just simply click over the update and after clicking the update okay click the and click the update and again you will get option and then again press that update and it will uh, next again and it will rest and download a ipsw file to your computer that is downloading and downloading process will takes around 30 minutes it depends on the network speed of the computer means network speed of the internet and after downloading just i will back and it will automatically restore without if the phone is connected until at uh, that time if the phone connect to the itunes if the phone uh, means automatically turns on then simply again do the same process hold the home key uh, hold the power key until phone gets to itunes mode and then connect it and then and then again click the uh, update restore update do not click the restore sorry update and then again next and the uh, process will start means downgrading process will be automatically start and the downloading process will takes around 30 minutes and uh, it's completely depend upon the network speed and after downloading uh, when you connect the phone again uh, do the same process as before and then after that it will takes around uh, uh, 30 minutes hardly first it will extract the software then uh, it's prepare the iPhone to uh, uh, means restore and then it will uh, restore that so the complete process means uh, after downloading the file it's completely takes around 30 minutes and after that uh, so I'm just changing the uh, room right now and then okay now it's uh, after fast forwarding the video and this is the file here and it's something uh, it's restored and after restored the phone is now booting up and the first boot will take normal time it's not so so it is hello and from this uh, battery icon you can identify that it's now downgraded to ios 10.3.3 and let me simply quick set up this and the password quickly set up the Wi-Fi password and everything okay now it's done after completely uh, it's completed and it's, uh, checking for iCloud okay now it's a uh, sim is not inserted so it's asking for a white sim but it's already downgraded from the battery icon you can easily identify that from this battery icon this is the battery icon of ios 10.3.3 so this is the way in that way you can easily downgrade your iphone from ios 11 to ios 10.3.3 so thanks for watching this if you like my video please click on thumbs up and don't forget to like and subscribe this video